So this is final look of the job that I done to the car. Installation of the snorkel. It's take me about uh, eight hours and two or three days to to put everything back. How you can see, I put some silicone. Uh, the snorkel is 56 bucks plus plus I spent like 30 35 dollars in Home Depot to buy silicon or flex pipe and all that stuff. Um, for those of you guys who gonna say hey you, you're a cheap guy or something like that it's better to buy original snorkel and spend extra 100 dollars but I'm not looking for easy ways guys and I enjoyed the process a lot so it's not stick a lot from the car if you want to see it's not creating any blind spot or something this is view from the driver's seat how can you see it's not creating any blind spot or something you can clearly see the street um, subscribe for channel guys thanks for watching and um, very shortly i'm gonna upload video how, how i did the paint camo paint job on this car thank you what's up guys uh today i'm gonna install snorkel on my montero sport um that snorkel is from uh, 97 up to 97 toyota land cruiser uh, i try to look for for original but it's it's only for sale in Europe and it's like 150 150 per snorkel so um, <clears throat> this one I got from eBay for 55 bucks I mean the I'm only worried about that angle and that's it I know it's not gonna fit perfectly over here but I wanna try to to fit it so watch it subscribe it like it please let's start first thing i'm gonna cut that hole Shh, i need i need somebody to hold the camera ay, ay, ay. Um, i'm gonna drill the hole and then i'm gonna try to to cut the circle You know what let me check first <coughs> okay. okay so let's let's try to cut the hole Okay, so if you're gonna do that, watch out because there is a there is a wires. So be careful. Now I don't know how I need to make the hole over there. Okay, so let's let's fit my snorkel so far. Let, I mean, let's try to fit it. Let's see how it's gonna look like. Okay, not like. I was expecting probably how can you see it's it stick too much out of the car so <clears throat> uh, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna try to hit uh, try to hit with the heater 
with the heat gun over here and I'm gonna try to bend it close to the to the to the roof so um, I need to cut fender like that because bottom part of the of the snorkel is about that, that, that point so I'm gonna try to cut it right now like this straight Okay, nice. Okay, um, the next step. So I got, I drilled the hole in the fender. Uh, I cut that, that I don't know, molding. Um, and I got already marks where I'm gonna drill uh, holes for for bolt to hold the to hold the snorkel by the way I did the I bend it so now it looks now it stick to the car more and I have to put some tape over here because plastic look looks like melted plastic it's it's look kind of nasty but but it looks much more better now How you can see it's much more close closer to the car so the, I'm gonna try to to <clears throat> drill, drill drill to those holes I'm gonna remove that that plastic cover on the wheel to be able to put na nuts over there because I don't because I don't have access from from the hood okay so I got the holes um, and I Remove the bottom cover, under wheel bottom cover. So that's the way how I'm gonna connect it to the air box. I got this this piece of flex pipe. Uh, I think two dollar, one seventy, and this piece. I think two forty or something. So I'm gonna do the hole inside the inside the box. I'm gonna I'm gonna put inside like this so it's gonna stick like this and then I'm gonna put the flex pipe on it so but so far I need to install it oh also also I need to to put another uh, connection over here so but this is easiest past part okay so let's do it Okay, so far I got this hanger installed. Put some silicone to protect it from uh, from the rust. Uh, also, I'm gonna put some silicone around around the whole thing to make sure it's not gonna rust it in a few months. So uh, now I'm gonna put it everything together. Let's see how it's gonna look like. Oh, by the way, this thing is gonna go like this to the box. Then I'm gonna cut the hole in the box. I don't know, maybe from this side, maybe from this side. I'm not sure yet. And actually, it doesn't really matter. All right, so keep watching, guys. Thank you. So this is result. I put some 
silicon to protect it and uh, and I and I use that spot to reach the to, re to reach the bolts that, that hold in uh, snorkel snorkel okay so it's it's getting dark right now I'm gonna continue tomorrow probably but it's almost finished I just need to cut the hole and that's it so keep watching okay so this is final look but I still need to cut the hole in the mirror box but now you can see how it looks like